imitators and the image likeness of God. A stereotype means widely held the fixed image or idea of a type of person or thing. Are you a stereotype, fixed image type of person, imitator, like Diane Hoon was seen to say and do, to live for and by the things that people love to serve them, to worship? Then you are an idol to them, like them, you and die. Forever, Ephesians 5. Be imitators of God, God, and his like is image, grow to his unseen, to say and do, to live for and through him. God's true words are right choices, therefore as judge of children, God, God, righteous like I am, live a life of love. God's love, Jesus Christ's love loves us and gave himself. Our first big offering for our sins, sacrifice to God, we belong to God himself, but among you. There must not even be a hint of sexual moral sexual any kind of impurity or greed, things. In abundance to worship because these are improper for God's holy people. Be imitators for your greed. Person, such person is an altar has an inheritance of the kingdom of God, Christ Jesus. They will die forever, but no one deceives you with empty eyes, all sins, words. For because such things, God's wrath, anger, comes in those who are just being to God. Therefore, do not be partners with them, partners with them. Then ever you are doctors, all sins, and lies. But now you are lying, lie, lie GHC, and God himself, the Lord. And as the children of God and light, have nothing to do with their fruitless deeds, all sins, lies of darkness, darkness. Expose him to God's light, for it is shameful even to mention what the disobedient to God. Do a secret thing exposed by the light of God becomes visible from God's light. Be very careful how to live as unwise our sins life say you do. You and die forever, but it's wise like God Himself to say and do. Imitators like to God Himself, be holy like God. That's from His kingdom, eternal life, treasures, home, belong, promise of love and life that's forever with God Himself. Amen. second get my song ready this is one of my older songs I have a new song but I haven't had no time at all on it so I'll try to sing it during the week when I do my uh, prayer and songs this one's called extended life Never end, never end, never end, never end with God. 
you for a second. I'm still getting used to this thing, so pardon me. Pardon me. Okay. Pardon me for a second. Marshall, Los Fisher Riverplex, Brothers and Sisters in Christ Jesus. It's the Lord's Supper Sunday, so have you ready. And there's a winter weather advisory. Early in the morning, Monday, and all day. And possibly up to eight inches of snow. So be careful there. Pardon me here. Okay, now this week's sermon is called a stereotype or imitators. Image likeness of God. Stereotype means a widely held but fixed image or idea of a type of person or thing. Are you a stereotype, fixed image type of person, imitator, like them? do to live for and by the things of people love and serve thy am to worship then you're an imitator of thy am like them a stereotype and you end die forever by the am Ephesians 5 be imitators of God 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 in his likeness image spiritual who's unseen to say and do to live for and through him God's two words are my choices therefore as dearly I love children of God God's righteous like God and live a life of love, God's love, just as Christ loved and loves us. And gave himself up for us as a frequent offering for our sins. And sacrifice to God. We belong to God himself. But in my there must not even be a hint, 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 hint. Of sexual morality or any kind of impurity or greed. Things in abundance to worship because these are proper for God's holy people. No immoral, pure, or greedy person, such a person as Iotar, Iotar, has an inheritance in the kingdom of Christ and of God, eternal life. They will die forever. Let no one deceive you with empty lies, our sins, lies, words. For because such things, people's gods, 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 wrath, anger comes on those who are disobedient to him, that's right. Therefore, do not be partners with them, no. For you were once darkness, I was a liar, but now you are lie, lie, GHT, and God himself, the Lord. Live as children of light in God. Have nothing to do with the fruitless, idle sins, lies, deeds of darkness. Like them. But expose them to God's light. For it is shameful even to mention what this will be to God, God do in secret, but everything is exposed. By the light of God, yes it is, becomes visible. From God's light, be careful then how you live, live not as unwise outer sinners and liars to say and do. You'll end die forever, but as wise in God himself to say and do. Imitate us like us of God himself and be holy like him. That's forever in his kingdom, eternal life, treasures home, and belong promise of love and life that's forever with God himself, amen. So remember that. Okay, now pardon me. Okay, now, this week's word is bliss, means perfect happiness, great joy, amen, amen. Galatians 5, 22, 26, God's love, peace, joy, lives in me, and it's perfect happiness and it's great joy, it lives in me. It fills me inside and truly makes me happy. He's all I need. I'm leaving my past behind. It's in my heart and mine on him. Jesus, remember this. Amen. Amen. I'm leaving so much more. It's good according to him. My hopes and dreams are 
are to him. Jesus, amen. My hands, I'm reach my hands to him. I'm leaving so much more. All he has is in store. And him is good, G-O-D. Saying, do heaven by the flesh, as saying, will you die forever by the name? 
Hey Amen. Okay, now ask yourself, are you winning the prize of eternal life with God? Or are you losing your life buying from the things people to love to worship like them? To live for and buy to say and do. Then you're losing your life and you end die forever by the am. But if you are little living for to come self, to love so far, worship, to say and do is to word right choices, to form to him, spiritual like him, then you win win winning and will win the prize, the prize, the prize of eternal life with God and his kingdom and live forever, amen. Pardon me, I'm thirsty, excuse me. Okay, now we are to be God's masterpiece. God himself, the spirit that lives in us completely together. He feels us completely signed, become his masterpiece, treasure, in Galatians 5, 2, 3, this God's love, peace, joy, etc. Through the spirit lives in us. He is our master as we serve him to love first, worship him as our Lord to God, to say to you, to live forward through him, right to spiritual. So we'll be united completely kingdom treasures of love and life forever with God himself amen okay now this week's Bible verse in Psalm 75 1 we get thanks to you oh God we get thanks to your name is near people tell of your wonderful day day days amen amen extra hope in your day I gotta do is look on and create the heavens and the earth and you and me and gave us our first birth of life here man okay now this week's children's lessons for everyone is Blocking out all of that in heart and mind, in other words, in heart, we are to love God Himself first. As love is too meaning, He created it in the beginning, and He was our real first love, relish to pour wholeheartedly in mind. Two things say do His two words and learn His language righteously, the right and true ones. Spiritually, the Spirit that lives in us, He's given us to be like Him, godly, fills us, can be decided, truly makes us happy, satisfies us. He's all we need, 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 need. And Man, has and in Galatians 5, 2, 2, this God's love, be sure the fruit of the Spirit is in us. As it's right to try people as we live for through, as just strangers here, just passing through here just for a short time, we belong, 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 belong to Him and our home treasures and promise of love and life in God's kingdom. Where we truly belong is with Him. Amen. Okay, now it's time for the Lord's Supper. Pardon me. I take mine every morning, 1 Corinthians 11, 22, 26. For whenever you eat this bread, Jesus' body, and drink the cup of grape juice, Jesus' blood, you proclaim the Lord Jesus' death on the wood cross for our sins and our lies. We prayed and gave them to Jesus' cross and let them die completely. On his cross, been reborn, new, purified, cleansed, crossed over from death and darkness, and rose into Christ Jesus' life and light in him. As he rose on Easter, now we live born through him to love, serve, follow him. He's our little ghost before us to worship, say his two words, right, right choices and language. Ways and well, righteous to spiritually like him and best friend. He feels us mean inside like I've been teaching him, makes us happy. Like I said, he's all we need. Let's fight when his free spirit lives in us. Let's fight when we sex, love, his joy, etc. Lives in us. We're his righteous people, disciples, tribe, Israelites. We're just strangers here, just passing through here for a short time. We belong to him and our home treasures and promise of love and life is in his kingdom. I've turned life with him. Therefore, whenever you just spread Jesus body and drink the cup of grape juice, Jesus' blood in an unearthly way. You haven't prayed and let your sins and idols lies die completely. You still say and do them. We'll be guilty, guilty, guilty of sin against Jesus Christ. You'll end die forever on this eternal judgment day. A person not to examine the person self doesn't sin, sin, sin anymore for taking the Lord's Supper. Without recognizing body and blood Jesus Christ, judgment on the person self. This is why many among you are weak and sick, weak and sick. For if they abide from all sins and lies, and I mean, have fallen asleep in their graves, die, then until Jesus comes again at the end of time, and lives with us righteous people in his new holy city, and lives forever with him. They the altar sinners and liars will burn the lake of fire forever with the world's altar sinners and liars forever. So remember that before taking the Lord's Supper. For I see from the Lord Jesus on the night he was betrayed, took bread, and gave thanks. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for your body and blood. He, Jesus, took it and said, take ye, take ye, now this is my body given to your members of me. In the same way, he took the cup of grape juice and said, take drink, take drink. This is my blood given to your members of me. The new covenant, 
Now bow your hands, close your eyes, and fold your hands in prayer of thanks to Jesus Christ in silence. Okay, now let's pray. The Lord's Prayer, Matthew 6, 9, 13, Luke 11, 2, 4. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses. We forgive those trespasses against us. Lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. Okay, now, without God himself, there will be nothing. There will be nothing. But darkness everywhere, no existence. He created the heavens, earth, and us in the beginning. He is the love and life and truth. Without his love and life and truth, there is darkness and death, lies, idols, and sayings. Words, ways, and will to say and do to live for and by, belong and home. That saying, and you end, die in the darkness, death forever, by and for them. Only God himself, God himself is our purpose, reason. Creator, God, 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 the truth in his two words, ways, and will to say and do, 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 to love his to love first, excuse me, and live forward to him, right you to spiritually, whose unseen spiritual belong to him, we live forever with him, his kingdom, home treasures belong, I have love and life and promise that's forever with him, with God, amen. So remember that. Great are you, Lord. of the whole assembly saying praise God's love be to you O Lord God 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 ever our father Israel God's righteous people from everlasting to everlasting yours O Lord is greatness and power and the glory and majesty of the splendor for everything in heaven and on earth is your, your, yours yours O Lord is the kingdom you are exalted as head of all wealth and honor comes from you you are the ruler, ruler of all things and people in your hands is strength and power for unto him to exalt and give strength to all. Now, our God, God, we give you thanks. And praise God's love, your glorious name. Pardon me here. But who am I and who is my people? That we should be able to give as good generously as this. Everything comes from you, you, you. And we have given you only what comes from you, your, your, your hands. We are angels and strangers here, just passing through for a short time in your sight. As for our forefathers, our days on earth are like a shadow without help, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh, God, oh Lord. As for all this abundance, we have provided a building, a temple for you, holy, your holy name. It comes from your hand, and all of it belongs to you, you. I know, my God, that you test the heart God's love, are pleased with integrity, and all these things have I given willingly and with honest intent. And now I have seen with joy, which fight with this God's love, peace, joy, etc. Now when you are righteous people who are here have given to you, O Lord God, for our father Abraham, Isaac, 
and Israel, God's righteous and faithful, keep the desires in the heart, God's love of your people forever and ever. In the heart, God's love, loyal to you, you, you. Amen. Oh, he brought me that one. Second Chronicles 36, 15 and 16. Our father sent to, sent to you through his messengers again and again because he had pity on his people on his dwelling place. But you mock God's messenger, despise his true words, and scoff at his prophets until the wrath anger of the Lord was aroused against his people and there. And there was no remedy. You're dying by and from your idle sins lies. Amen. Amen. You die forever by and from them. Okay, pardon me. Jesus, in the name of the Lord. In case I can't get out tomorrow. Okay, pardon me. Okay, Psalm 119, starting at verse 129. Your statutes are wonderful, therefore I obey them. This unfolding of your, your, your two words give light, L I G H T, it gives understanding to the simple. I open my mouth and pant, longing for your commands. Turn to me, 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 and have mercy on me, 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 as you always do to those who love, love your name. Direct my footsteps according to your true words. Let no sin, sin, sin rule over me, me, me. Redeem or save you. Redeem, save me from the oppressor of people, men. If I may obey your precepts. Make your face shine, shine upon your righteous servant and teach me your, your decrees. Streams, tears flow through my eyes, for your law is not obeyed. Righteous are 
are you, O oh Lord? Are your laws all right for unto you? The statutes you have laid down are righteous. They are fully trustworthy. My zeal wears me out, for my enemies ignore your true words. Your promise have been truly tested, tested, and your righteous servant loves I am, though I am lowly and despised. I do not forget your, your precepts. Your righteousness are everlasting, and your law is true, true, true. Trouble and distress have come upon me, but your commands are my delight, my delight. Your statutes are forever right born through God. Give me understanding so that I may live, live, live. I call with my heart God's love answers me, O Lord. For I will be your decrees. I call out your, you, you save me. And I will keep your statutes. I rise before dawn and cry for help, help, help. I have put my hope in you, your true words. My eyes stay open through the watches of the night and I may meditate on your promise. Hear my voice according with your love. Preserve my life, O Lord, according to your, your laws. Those who devise, excuse me, wicked altar sinners and liars schemes are near, but they are far from my, my your, excuse me, from your law. Yet you are near, O Lord, and all your, your commands are true. Long ago I learned from your statutes that you established them to last forever. Amen, amen. Okay, clause states. Well, let's see, nine. Pardon me, I'm thirsty. So we're reflecting on the person and conclude that the righteous and the wise and into God and what they do are in God, God, God's hands, but no person knows whether love, love or hate awaits the person. I'll share a common destiny. The righteous born to God and the wicked, out of sinners and liars, the good born to God and the bad, out of sinners and liars, the clean born to God and the unclean, out of sinners and liars, those who offer sacrifice and those who do not. As it is with the good, good person, so with the sinner, as with those who take oaths, so with those who are afraid to take them. This is the all sins and lies, and everything that happens under the sun, the same destiny overtakes them the heart. Love serves to worship a people more or full of evil, all sins lies, and there is madness in their hearts by them, in their hearts by them. While they live, and afterward they will join the dead, die forever. Anyone who is among the little living has hope, even a little living dog is better than a dead lion. For the living know that they will die, 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 but the dead dies forever, no, and they know nothing. They have no, excuse my nose, it's just further reward, and even the memory of them is forgotten, they'll die forever. Their love, their hate, their jealousy have long vanished. Never again will they have a part and any that happens under the sun, go, 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 eat your food with gladness and drink your wine with a joyful heart, for it is now that God favors what you do. Always be clothed in white, born through God, and always anoint your head with oil. Enjoy life with your wife whom you love, and all the days of meaningless life. That God has given you under the sun, all your meaningless days, for this is your lot in life and your toilsome under the sun. Whatever your hands finds to do, to do, do it on in might. For in the great altar, sinners and liars dies forever. There they are going, neither their work, nor planning, nor knowledge, nor wisdom. I have seen something else under the sun. The race is not swift or the battle is strong. Nor does food come from, come to the wise or wealth, to the brilliant or favor to the learned. But time, chance happen to them. Moreover, no person knows when the person's hour will come. As fish caught in a cruel net or birds are taken in snare, so people are trapped by evil, I was sins, lies, times that falls exposed upon him and expected upon him. I also saw under the sun this ample wisdom 
that greatly impressed me. Therefore, was once a small city with only a few people in it, and a powerful king ruler came against it, surrounding it with the bill huge siege works against it. Now there lived in the city a person poor and but wise. The person saved the city by the person's wisdom, but nothing remembered that poor person. So I said wisdom is better than strength, but the poor person's wisdom is despised and the person's words are no longer heeded. The quiet words of the wise are more to be heeded than the shouts of the ruler of fools. Wisdom is better than weapons of war, but one sinner destroys much good. Amen, amen. I don't know, he brought me that one. Amen. Excuse me, I'm we done a lot of praising God. Okay, pardon me here. He's giving me a lot of Bible verses. Excuse me here. Pardon me. So pardon me here. Matt, Mark 7, starting at verse 20 to 23. He went on what comes out of a person. Oh, I just read this one last week. Pardon me. Oh, well. But within the person's heart, loves comes evil thoughts, sexual morality, theft, murder, adultery, greed, love and serve money, or things in abundance. Malice, deceit, lunas, envy, slander, arrogance, and folly. These will evil, evil, evil comes from inside and makes the person unclean. Amen, amen. Remember that? I read that last week. I didn't remark that one. Amen. 
without you. No, no, I don't want to live without him. Amen, amen. There is no life without him. <laughs> There's only death and darkness forever but without him. Okay, this week says Ephesians 5. Pardon me. God, therefore, is there a little love, children of God, and live a life of love, God's love, and brother and sister love, God's love to God's love. Jesus Christ love loves us and gave himself up for us as a fragrant offering and sacrifice to God. God. But among you, there must not even be a hint of sexual morality, which is unmarried sex, or cheating on your spouse, or any kind of impurity, or greed, love, and serve money in abundance, or things in abundance, because they are improper for God, God's holy people. Nor should be obviously foolish talk or coarse joking, which are out of place, but rather thanksgiving, prayer to God. For of this you can be sure, no more moral, impure, or greedy person, such a person is an idol to idol to remember that. Has the inheritance and kingdom of, of Christ uh, God? Let no one deceive you with empty words, idol sins, lies. For because of such things, God, God's wrath anger comes on those who are disobedient to him. That's right. Therefore, do not be partners with them. No, don't be partners with them. For you were once darkness, outer sinners, and liars, but now you are light in God and into God and the Lord. Live as children of light for the fruit of the right. And into God consists of all goodness for unto him. Righteousness and truth and find out what pleases the Lord. Have nothing to do with the fruitless deeds of darkness. What a shame for him to mention what the disobedient to God do in secret, but everything is exposed by God's light. Becomes visible. For it is the light of God that makes everything visible. This is why it is said, wake up, O sleeper, rise from the dead. You are to sinners and liars. And Christ will shine in and on you. Be very careful then how you live, live, live not as unwise, outer sinners and liars, but as wise and into God. Make the most of every opportunity because the day are, days are evil, outer sinners and liars. Therefore, do not be foolish, but understand what the Lord's will is and into Him. Do not get drunk on wine, which leads to debauchery. Instead, be filled with the Spirit, Spirit of God. Speak to one another with psalms, hymns, and spiritual songs. Sing, 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 and make music in your heart of God's love to the Lord. Always give thanks to God the Father. For everything in the name, in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Submit to one another out of reverence for Christ. Amen, amen. You know, you brought me that one. In Philippians 4.13, I can do everything through Christ Jesus who gives me strength. Amen, amen there. I don't want to live without you, no, no. Amen there. Well, that's all the Bible verses I have. Amen. Okay, everybody. I got to hurry up and drop this off and get some groceries and I guess I'll ride my exercise bike. Number one, God himself comes first. Our God, creator, purpose, to love first, serve. Him, worship, best friend, he's faithful. We are to be faithful to him as his true words and language to say and do righteously, truthfully and spiritually like him. Godly as our real true first love, husband, spouse, Revelation 2, 4, Jeremiah 3, 14, the Lord God says, I am your husband's spouse. And Isaiah 54, 5, for you, Lord God, maker, maker and creator is your husband's spouse, vows to first and promise. And the Bible is commandments 20, God's 10 commandments, Mark 12, 29, 20, 31, his greatest commands. He lives in us, fills us completely, and truly makes us happy, satisfies us. He's all we need. The fruit of the Spirit always fights with us, so God's love, peace, joy, etc. lives in us. Trust in God, trust also in me, says Jesus, in John 14, 1. To lean on, call, rely upon, depend on, belong to Him. He's in control of, He's our lead leader. We put on the former God of visions. 6, 10, 18, from the flaming arrows of the evil one, all sins light that comes at us all the time. So, so what say and do the true and right ones for the God himself, the tests, trials, and tribulations. As God's righteous people, tribe, children, Israelites, and we are only strangers here. Excuse me. I'm thirsty. Passing through here for a short time. We belong at home and treasures are in God's kingdom of love and life and his promise eternal life with him that's forever. Number two, come to health. 
spouse and yourself. Number three comes work 45 hours a week. Number four comes two friends from my number one purpose from our organization. Preach the gospel, the Holy Bible, God's truth. And help save and guide his righteous people home. God's kingdom to our life. Number two is help him. Number three is help make our community a better safe place to live. I've emailed the governor pure and he's pure and some issues. Excuse me, I'm really thirsty. In Peoria to take down the lights. That's off of Jefferson Street that goes on the Highway 74's bridge to East Peoria. That's on the ramp midway. It's a major accident ready to happen. The light turns red to green and I've almost had a few accidents there. And replace it and replace it for a yield sign, yield sign instead. And I pick up trash in my neighborhood when weather permits to help keep it clean from trash debris. I've adopted it to help keep it a nice and peaceful, safe neighborhood. And I'm ordained pastor. If you need my services, prayers, or have ideas for our community, you can email me. And truckers are watching my sermons on the Wi-Fi on my three-level apartment house. Um, I've rented the upstairs for several months, so. Anyway, we're working on the ceiling tiles this week and in East Peoria's cities. Brush pickup is February 15th through 19th, and I want to thank every business, restaurants, fire and police departments, carriers, livers, pastor, teachers, etc., for what you do for our community. And the reference to my metaphysical social help and OSF there in T, excuse me, in Tier 2, pardon me, in Tier 2, they've started small classes. I think it's up to 10 people. And open Monday through Friday, 5 a.m., 7 p.m., Saturday, 7 a.m. to noon, and close Sunday for members only. And you have to wear masks at all times, except in pools. The regular lap and therapy pools are open, and you have to reserve the lap pool. And I had a good workout in the regular pool yesterday. Thanks. God bless you for that. I am. Okay, now helping our community. During the coronavirus, excuse me, I'm trying to do this in a hurry. Pardon me. That I know about. You can't get a vaccine for the virus. So you call your doctor and find out when you get the shot. And another stimulus package of 600 and lost wages assistance, extra 300 a, a week, and employment on FEMA's site to apply for at least eight weeks and small business loans through Congress PPP's funding until March and on PPP site and approved Coronavirus Aid CARES Act funding for rental assistance on LEAPS, L-I-E-G-A-P-S side to apply. They are also taking applications on electric bills and on your mortgage holder. You can get forbearance or mortgage help for three months and I think they're taking applications for HARP replacement program 2020 or refinance your mortgage. The interest is low right now. It lower your mortgage every month. Okay, and on this side, you can do all of my songs. I preach and sing and pray and sing every week and try and write a new song. My youngest son helps me on in and my oldest son's in charge of the side. And donations, donations. I've taught you on teas and offerings given to the Lord God. We are to give a tenth of our money to the Lord or you are robbing God and under his curse. If you don't, Deuteronomy 14, 20, 23 and Malachi 3, 8, 9. Thanks and God bless if you do donate. And missing children still do noise are on the side. There was a missing 50-year-old woman, Maura, excuse me, I think it's R. Ellison of Peoria. She was found dead in a homicide. Police are investigating Thursday. Okay, now let's pray. Our God Almighty, we pray to you as our real true God. Creator, thank you for creating the heavens, earth, and us. And giving us our first breath of life here. And give your son, Jesus Christ, who suffered and died for us in our sins, we pray. They have died on the cross. We've been reborn, new, purified, cleansed, crossed over from death and darkness to his life, enlighten him. To live born through God, the Almighty, and your truth, to say and do them as your righteous people and obey and by your commands, laws, and decrees. To love, for serve, and worship, we pray for Maura's family and the missing just the right moment. And their families, so thanks to those that are found so and home safely. And the coronavirus in the United States, 25 million cases, 417,000 deaths, and other countries for them and their families. 
California's wildfire for the victims, riders, protesters, so there'll be peace with each other and get along as an equal the snowstorm that's heading our way tomorrow to protect us, amen, so we'll be okay. God the Almighty, we thank you for the help in creating the vaccine for the virus, and God, for your publisher, for your books. I've written for you the first one that will be published, published this year are in your hands, Lord God Almighty, and for Mark, Joseph, George, Dan, Pastor Dice, Paul's wife, and mother -in Joe, David, me have health problems, Rebecca, Robin, Austin, Heather, John, Mike, Don, Ron, Donald, and his girlfriend, and 25, 26 year old daughters are going through something personal, and God, we pray for the doctors, and nurses, restaurants, businesses, delivers, carers, police, and fire departments, ambulance, pass away for their families, for us and our enemies, those that are against us, righteous as your righteous people to protect us. Oh God, the unemployed, bankrupt, homeless, sick, and in pain, veteran soldiers, new president, rulers of our state and cities, teachers, students, Operation Light Resolve, we pray to you, oh God, in the morning. At Mills and at night, thanks to you, we have strength in you faithfully. And trusting you, we totally belong to you as our comfort or shelter tests, trials and tribulations through and from them. So we're saying do the two words and right choices for unto you, O oh God. The Almighty, we're like you and your tribe, people. Children and Israelites, we are only strangers here, passing through here for a short time. You are our leader, leader, so we'll make it to our real true home. Where we belong in your kingdom and treasures, promise the love and life that's forever with you, O oh Lord God Almighty. I live forever. Amen, amen. Okay, now if I have room, I'll do sing another song. Okay, now may the love, peace, joy, temple, home, treasures, righteousness, faithfulness, true words, language, articles of God, spirit, light, ways. Wheel, customs, tradition, praise, glory, holiness, salvation, strength, power, cure. Promise, vows of God being with you all. And be ready for Jesus, eternal judgment, day, truth, and kingdoms near. And the end of all things, people's near. First Peter 4, 7. And the things and people from the Holy Bible still is in today's world. Emmanuel means God's with us, one nation under God, God bless America and God we trust, and God's temple is to be built in us through God's true words and spirit to say and do, to live for and by his true words and do righteously. For unto him, that's forever in his kingdom, with him, not by him from the things people are money to say and do, to live for and by. You'll end die forever by and for them. And God's righteous faithful are truly building up, building up God's foundation, God, for God's righteous people, tribe, children, Israelites, to his treasures, home, city, and kingdom of eternal life in his new holy city and live forever with God himself. And God's fires kindles the lit. And remember who and what's saying is temporary to say and do to live for and by them. Ends dies forever by and from them. But who's unseen, spiritual, God himself is permanent to say and do his true words and right choice to live for and through. It's the everlasting with God and his kingdom of eternal life. Amen. Okay, now be careful. Be careful. It's supposed to get bad weather. A lot of snow starting early tomorrow, Monday, and lasts all day. I'm going to the store and stock up for tomorrow just in case. So, and we'll have a nice and peaceful week. God bless. I'll keep you updated. On help during the coronavirus, as I know things. Thank you. Um, so, if I have on my cam recorder, I'll do another song. So, thank you and God bless you. This one's called Breathe In Now, God's Breath Alive.
amen, amen. Okay, I want to hurry up and very shut up, so pardon me if it does. This week's song is called A Stereotype or Imitators and Women's Likeness of God. Stereotype means a wildly held from fixed image or idea or type person or thing. In other words, who and what's saying. Type of person, imitator like them. To say and do to live for and by the things and people, the less serve them and worship. Then you're an imitator of them like them, you end die forever by and from them. You must be imitators of God and his likeness. To say and do, to live for and do. To love and serve and worship. Say his two words and right choice for unto him. That's forever with him is kingdom of eternal life. Amen, amen. Okay, that's it. I'm um, just very shut off. So anyway, thank you and God bless you. Have a nice Christmas for the rest of the week. Um, and be careful. It's supposed to get really bad weather tomorrow, Monday. So be careful. Um, and we thank you and God bless you.